All right, what is up? This is Slow Playthroughs of Max from Mario Kart 8. So in the last episode, I'll just take on 150cc Shell Cup. In this part, we're going to be taking on 150cc Banana Cup, guys. And uh, apparently, I got Pink Gold Peach. I just received it today or something like that. I guess because of all the coins I got, I unlocked this new character. And uh, personally, I think it's kind of stupid just because it's like, okay, it's just like Metal Mario. She's a heavy version, but just the name, like Pink Gold Peach. Like, why couldn't it be like maybe like... I don't even know, just gold peach or something other than, like, it's just hilarious. It doesn't make any sense, but, you know, I got a little request today or uh, a few days ago asking for baby Rosalina to use. So, I'm going to go with her just because she's, like, a new character and stuff. We go with the Prancer, Azure Roller. As you can see, all the stats are pretty good in the Cloud Glider. Those are the most decent I'm going to get to. So, we're going to do this cup right here, and I am so pumped, guys. Like, you guys don't understand how awesome it is. Before we get started... Do me a huge favor, hit that like button, let's try to reach 10 likes, that'd be amazing, I'd love you guys forever, and you'd love me back, right? Right, 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 right? Yeah, that's right, yeah, alright, cool. But, uh, yeah, summer officially, has officially started, school is over, junior year has been completed, I think of life as a video game, you know, all the time. This is, like, one of the hardest levels, you know how in video games there's always that one le level, almost at the end, or in between, that's super hard, but it's not quite the last level yet? or like the final stage, that's what junior year was to me. It was a big, it was a huge threat. Like, it could have went either way. I could have had a great year and uh, not have any problems at all. Or it could have just been a sucky-ass year and I would have failed like every single class, you know, made no friends and not really hung out with any of my older friends. But, you know, it went exactly the way as I wanted it to. You know, I expected it to be like this. To just go through it like normal, enjoy life, have fun let's playing at the same time, you know? Just YouTube, coming home from a bad day at school, like, it really, it really just is an amazing feat at, at itself. Like, it's just, it makes me so happy to think about that. Like, I remember one day I had a horrible day at school. I think I got, like, 70-something on a quiz or something like that. And for me personally, like, I, I really want, like, A's and even a high B would satisfy me but a's are just up my ass like those are just amazing i want those so badly and i work hard for those and whenever i see that 70 i'm just like holy crap what the hell was i doing like did i not sleep right did i not study the right materials what what and i look at it and it just it's just a huge disappointment and then after that i come home and i'm like i'm having a bad day what, what, what am i gonna do like what, what am i supposed to do that will not make me f have this like horrible feeling you know and then, of course, I, I go freaking uh, on YouTube. I, I watch some people maybe do some Let's Plays or something occasionally. And then I see see myself. I'm like, you know what? I need to, I need to make a video. I got to make a video today. So I go at it, make myself really happy person just being able to record some YouTube videos. What the freaking butt sack, man? And it just makes me feel great. So... I decided to come home today, go ahead and start recording some more Mario Kart 8 for you guys, and I'm, ha I'm, I'm getting a lot of positivity from these videos. Like, a lot of you are enjoying it, and that just makes me really happy that you guys are enjoying the content that I'm putting out, especially Mario Kart 8, because this is a really fun game, and it's just it's just a way to unwind and, un like, relax. This is a perfect, this is, like, perfect timing. Like, they knew exactly when to release this game, and they did it so well at, like, a perfect time. It's great. It's great shit right there. Good shit. Good shit. Because not only do I get to enjoy my summer break, I get to enjoy video games with it. Doing online matches and stuff. And don't worry, guys. I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. You're like, but we don't want to always see Mario Kart. Don't worry, guys. Mario Kart's not the only Let's Play that will be on this channel. All right? I got tons and tons of plans for you guys over this summer. It's going to be a great summer. It's going to be very successful. I already know it. Like, I know it's going to be a fun great experience for you guys and for myself too like uh, i need to grow as a let's player and as a commentator and stuff i need to just enjoy what i'm doing like always and i'm super pumped for this summer it's gonna be great hope you guys are too because right now i'm gonna tell you some of the plans i have just just uh kind of a summer at glance if you will um nothing set in stone yet but what i've been planning on is doing a zelda let's play so as you know, I did Link Between Worlds in November, yeah, November, late November, and I did, uh, that was the first Let's Play I've ever done, like, complete, 
Like, 100%. Like, I got every freaking thing in that game. Like, there wasn't anything I was missing. So, if you think about it, like, that that's that's a really successful thing. Like, that that makes me feel great that I was able to do that. It boosts my confidence. Like, hey, this is the first... Holy shit! I just got bounced off like a freaking ragdoll. Holy damn butts. That was not what I wanted to happen. But hey, you know, we can't, we can't always get what we want, alright? This is a lot- Oh my god, stop it! <laughs> stop it, you jerk, man! Life lesson right there, guys. You can't always get what you want, so, yeah. But yeah, I decided, let's go ahead and do a Zelda Let's Play over the summer. I was planning on doing probably a, uh, hmm. I was thinking probably Wind Waker HD or um, one of my- I think this is my favorite game of all time. I'm pretty sure it is. The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D for the 3DS. Like, that would be great. Do you have a blooper, Mario, dude? What do you think you're doing? What am I doing in sixth place? I should be in first. What is this? This should be a conspiracy. This is not... Not what's supposed to happen. Oh, thanks for the boost. Kakadooki. Kakadooki Mookie Shuki. You guys are shiitake mushrooms, alright? I'm like, shit take. That's how you spell it. <laughs> I just noticed that. Like, I remember at school the other day, we were looking up shit on uh, mushrooms and stuff and plants for uh, one of my classes. And we saw shiitake mushrooms. I, I was just looking at it. I was like, shit take mushrooms. Like, what the hell, dude? Like, who came up with that? It's hilarious. But yeah, I have a really disgusting mind. And I'm, I'm an idiot at times. And uh, I say most of the time I am. Holy crap, I finished in second place. Thank God, I went from six to second. Larry, he's living like Larry, getting up there. Screw him. Oh, yeah. Man, I am exhausted from school today. I took that physics final. Dude, I'm gonna blow my freaking head off. Seriously. <laughs> Royal Raceway, Raceway, Ray. The Royal Raceway. Excellent. And I just screwed up. I don't get the boost. Damn it. Oh, sweet. I do. Never mind. Never mind. I stand corrected. Don't hurt me. Ah! Oh, shit. What the hell? Turning on this car is... It's very unreliable. And what I mean by that is, like, I'm going through it. Have some good turning at times. At other times, it's kind of weird. Oh, you just took my shit, bro. I'm gonna die? Sometimes that can work to my advantage. Like, if I don't get an item, then I don't go in front of someone, and I get those occasional times where I don't get hit by an item, like that I would have been hit by. So, say I got a boost, like a mushroom boost. Guy had a red shell, went in front of him, use that red shell, and I'm dead. Easy as that. What game is this from? Is this from, uh... I don't even know. Oh my god, my banana. Someone burned it. Somebody disintegrated my freaking banana. Oh, these damn coins. <laughs> Let this set the tone for the rest of the game, guys. Coins up the butt. I might as well be playing New Super Mario Bros. 2. You should just call this Mario Kart New Super Mario Bros. 2. Yep, yep. That seems like a great name. I would pay good money for that. Not because the game was good or not. Just because of the name. Take my money, Nintendo. Take it now. Piranha plants everywhere. Nintendo 64. I can't remember what game this is from. And I just got butt fucked right there. Oh, look, they're right behind me. Man, I made. I covered a lot of ground. Very proud of myself so far. Ooh, a red shell. Delicious. Dun, 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 dun. Just as long as no one gets that blue shell, I am good to go. Dun, 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 bum, bum, dun, dun. I mean, I love this music. I say the Nintendo 64 had probably the some of the best Mario Kart music. And the best tracks was probably uh, Double Dash. Double Dash, I love that game so much. That was the best Mario Kart game. I don't care what anyone says. They say Mario Kart Wii is the best Mario game. I'm going to cry because... I personally didn't like that just because it was like, eh. You know what I mean by eh. It wasn't awful, but it was still pretty decent. The graphics were improved and everything, but yeah. That's so weird. I wonder if they had this planned out. 
every single i don't even know like how if it's like every single whatever years, but Mario Kart Wii and Super Smash Bros. Brawl came out in the same year. And Mario Kart 8 and Super Smash Bros. Uh, Wii U and 3DS are coming out the same year too. Coincidence? I think not. I don't think so. Like, there's no way that they would just be like, oh, okay, you know, I'm just gonna release these two games at the same time. No, they know in dire situations, Nintendo always pulls something right out of their ass. Like, they're like, okay... We don't know what game to release right now. Every game we're releasing is garbage, and they obviously know it because they're releasing this crap, and they're just like, oh, the sales, they're shit. They're like, they're put to shame. Like, Yoshi's Island, or whatever it was, Yoshi's New... What the hell? I did that perfectly. What? This car is, like, cursed or something. But yeah, like, I don't know what is going on with Nintendo... They, so far, have been doing very well with the sales of this game. But I'm telling you, it probably won't last just because of the factor that, hey, it's like the Wii. You know, they got lucky with the uh, Wii controls, like the whatever they were promoting, their gimmicks and everything. Like, oh, hey, we got control, like the uh, motion controls and stuff. And it's good for health. It's exercising. Your kids will be healthy and not overweight and all that good shit, you know. But then when you think about it, you're like... Was that Nintendo's intentions at the beginning? No, it evolved into that. Their intentions were, hey, we're going to make this motion control bullshit and hopefully make a lot of money off of it. And hey, it worked, and they got super lucky, and that's great and all, but at the same time, it's like, hey, I know you you guys want to appeal to the, like, the audience as a whole, like kids, adults, everyone, but you can't always rely on that shit. Like, I'm not even, I'm not even joking, like... That can really hurt you. God damn, I, I feel sorry for Bowser. He just got destroyed, and I feel sorry for myself because I just fell like a dumbass. <laughs> oh, yeah. But yeah, same thing with the Wii U. They were thinking, okay, hey, we made a lot of money with the Wii the first time. Let's try it with the Wii U. And what do you know? The Wii U flopped. Flopped like hell. And personally, for me, I'm just saying this as, like, the whole gaming community. Not many people bought the Wii U, but for myself... I think the Wii U is a great system. Like, it it deserves more praise than it has gotten. Like, it's gotten a lot of negativity. I love it. Like, I don't care what people say, oh, Xbox, PS4, the Xbox One, all that shit. Nobody gives a crap. Like, oh, okay, actually, never mind. Everyone, they love that crap. But, like, personally, me, like, I'm, I was never, I have the 360, I have the PS3. You know, I don't play any mainstream, like, Call of Duty or anything like that. I mean, you guys might be like, oh, what the hell's wrong with you, dude? You get in that Call of Duty. But no, seriously, Call of Duty is just not one of those games that I enjoy. First-person shooters are just not something I was into. I've always been a Nintendo fanboy, and I don't really want to say I am, but, I mean, if you think about it, I, I can't just deny it. Like, it's, it's a fact. Like, I've always defended Nintendo, no matter what, and I just love everything they put out. Except for Paper Mario Superstar and uh, Yoshi's New Island. Those games are fucking awful. <laughs> uh, Yoshi's New Island, not that much, but it's a guarantee for uh, Paper Mario Superstar. I, I cannot believe how much of a disappointment that game was. Like, you just have to think about it. Like, you've been looking forward to another Paper Mario, Mario RPG. Comes out for the 3DS, you're like... This is everything I want. Should have been like bread and butter. Like the combination was perfect. Portable RPG, just like Pokemon, but it's Paper Mario this time and not Mario Luigi Saga or whatever. And you see it and you're just like, God damn. It was horrible. Like they, this, the integration and everything that they did was such a disappointment. But, you know, that's my little rant on the whole Nintendo situation, guys. Uh, we did pretty well, actually. I'm surprised. We got first place uh, three times and second place once. Uh, just one thing to mention. Uh, fuck you, Donut Plains. You just ruined my uh, first place streak. <laughs> but no, seriously. Hopefully we got two stars. One star or two star. I would love it if they would just give it to me. Come on. <laughs> yeah, two stars. Nice, good stuff. New character. That's it. No new car combination. Nothing like that. Garbage. Alright guys, well, thank you all so much for watching, putting up with that rant I just had and everything, but uh, yeah, I'll talk to you guys in the next one, take care.